Okay. Uh, just thought I'd come on for a wee bit. Um, first find of the day. That weird looking thing. Now, is that the centerpiece uh, from a old car bonnet? Maybe. Um, I'm gonna keep that because that's. Ooh, shit. I'm gonna keep that because that's pretty cool. Um, and to be honest, yeah, it's off something. It looks like it's off a bonnet of some sort. So I'm gonna keep that because that's pretty cool, man. Um, I'll clean that up. And there's actually numbers in there. You can't make them up, but there's numbers in it and a couple of we uh, like sort of signs. But we'll have a look in there later on. Um, and clean it up, and we'll have a look and try and find out what it is. Oosh. right next to the officer's mess. Um, just found this. A little looks to be a lighter um, with some sort of marking on the side. If anyone knows what that is then please let me know. Uh, I've also just found a uh, I think this is a uh, Vermark temp peg I think from what I've seen before with other people. Um, just missing the, the loop at the top there. Yeah, I think it's a temp peg of Vermark. Not too bad so I'm gonna put them I'm going to come back for a minute a bit once I've finished doing the rest. Now, I'm not too sure, um, but I think I could have found a pretty cool coin here. Um, 10 kroner. Whatever 10 kroner is. Um, yeah. There you go. I don't know, I think it's Danish maybe? Got, I'll show you, you'll be able to see it later on better when I take pictures of it, but that is pretty cool. I think it's, mm, I don't know, whatever Krona I come from. Denmark, Danish maybe. It's pretty cool. Ah, wicked. Right, I'll let it clear up. And show you later. Oosh. Mind you, come to think about it, the Danish SS were based here. Now, if that's a 10 Krona, that could have been Danish. Brought by a Danish SS soldier. Let's just hope so. Let's have a look at the date later. Oof. So what we've come across here is uh, that looks like an up upside down stove. Um, yeah. A trend system going on over there. However, just found this line in the open. See that? 1944. That, my friends, is a jerry can, an original jerry can from 1944. Cool, though. I don't know if there's any markings anywhere else, but. Um, yeah, WD, I suppose, 1944. Um, you can just make out water there. Just, see it? Yeah. Water. Cooler. Very nice. Oosh. Alright, um, awesome find by the way, just to let you know, there's the uh, camp, my camp, um, and as you can see I'm in a little trench system, uh, <laughs> I've only got to find a dog tag for a POW, these were given to uh, the POWs by the Germans, now there was a star like literally out the front gate uh, of here, um, so Boom. I'm going to clear that bad boy up and uh, hopefully uh, there'll be some details on there. How awesome is that? That is an awesome find. Bang. Let's see what uh, what else comes out of this little hole. But that's mint, man. 
hopefully uh, that's got some markings on it. So um little hole over yonder, um that's just all oh, this little oh, um no I might be mistaken here but they I believe are uh gas mask holders, firm gas mask hold casters. Um if you look there that's part of the uh, gas mask. Um yeah, there's bits bits of stuff, what is it? Um two I don't know. just had a piece of gas. There you go, look at that. Gas mask. Well, part of uh, gas mask. Thank you, look at that. Um, but yeah, I mean. That. Don't know. Don't want that off. If anybody knows what that's off, then let me know, will you? Um, there's a uh, little seat. But they're definitely gas mask canisters, definitely. Um, and they're obviously part of uh, gas mask. And... Where is it? Is that going on? Yeah, so, not a bad little find, actually. Um, I'll leave them there, because, yeah, they're, they're knackered, so... Um, but yeah, not bad at all, we'll keep going.